Good evening, everyone. We have Catherine Sebov here from Team Canada. We'll start with questions in the room and then we'll move over to the Zoom call. If you'd like to ask a question on the Zoom call, please use the raise hand function. And we'll invite you to unmute yourself and ask your question accordingly. We'll start with questions in the room. Gentlemen. Catherine, it seemed like you really rallied through the second set there and took that momentum into the third. What happened? Um, yeah, I was a little bit overwhelmed with the atmosphere uh, going in. Uh, that still kind of hits me. Um, but I'm glad I was able to get it together in the second and try to get some more balls in and play better and, uh, you know, give a fight to Greet. Uh, she was obviously playing really well from the start, like I had to take it from her. And uh, yeah, like, I mean, she played really well and uh, I wasn't quite there today, in my opinion. Um, it seemed like you were talking to the, to the lines a little bit. Is that something that you do in your game? Oh yeah, all the time. <laughs> <laughs> I need to work on that. <laughs> Karina? Hi, Catherine. Um, what was the feeling like when you first got called up to this team? And now that you've kind of experienced it, how has the week been for you? Um, I mean, I was happy to get the call. I was uh, like, I always like to represent Canada. I think it's an honor and uh, it's once in a lifetime opportunity or, you know, like it, it doesn't happen too often. And um, I mean, it's been a great week, a great learning opportunity for me. and. Uh, I used it as a training week, and it was excellent for me. Um, I really like the team is awesome, and uh, I would love to, you know, do it again sometime. You said the crowd felt a little bit overwhelming. Tell me a little bit more about that. Like, how are you gonna like learn from what this like the atmosphere was like moving forward? Uh, I'm just used to more of a quiet setting, like being on court 17 and <laughs> nobody's watching, you know. So it's a, a little bit of an adjustment, um, and you know, just like staying focused even though there's like a lot going on and a lot of noise and you know lights flickering and everything so i think it's just something that i need to get used to and but i mean i'm not complaining it, it was an amazing atmosphere i obviously want to be in that you know atmosphere atmosphere all the time so yeah yeah i better get used to it but yeah. And last question, like you have been in the spotlight more mm -hmm. a lot recently. Um, mm -hmm. How do you stay grounded in those moments? Because it's all about really balancing the highs and the lows. Um, I mean, I'm not entirely sure how to answer. Um, like, I don't think of myself like more highly because of, I mean, if that's what you mean, like I don't think of myself more highly because I am in that spotlight. Uh, I still think I'm you know, the same person, the same player, and uh, I just happen to be doing it at a very high level. And um, yeah, it's, it's all the same to me. Yeah. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Pete. <clears throat> Catherine, not that's all you wanted today, but generally it's been a really strong start to the year for you. You've got a lot of great results, a lot of career firsts. What are some of the lessons you're going to take away from this week to try to continue to ascend to the season? Uh, well, I need to work on like a few things. If I want to improve my game, if I want to step up the level, um, if I want to like win more at, uh, at the highest level, I need to get faster, I need to serve bigger, I need to um, get more consistent with what I'm doing and uh, you know take my chances more when I have opportunities and just be confident doing that um, you know I, I would say that's like that's what I would take away and because uh, I, I want to win at the highest level so I will make those adjustments um, just one question about your opponent um, have you played uh, against her before? And um, what was the most difficult to handle uh, in her game today? I don't think I've even practiced with Greet. Like I know, like I know her from juniors. I know she was a very good junior as well. Um, uh, today, like I didn't really expect her to play, you know, that fast. To be honest, I thought she was more like a clay court player, <laughs> but she played extremely fast and. You know, it, it rushed me in the beginning, especially, and 
Um, tactically, I think she played pretty smart against me as well, like really like being aggressive and not getting giving me that you know um, that front foot. Um, and she she just didn't really give me anything. Like she was very consistent doing what she was doing, and I think she just played smarter than I did today. Yeah. Thank you. Shaba. Sorry, Catherine. I want to ask um, when you knew that you were going to play today. When did you find out? I found out like late last night. And what was your reaction at that point? Um, I mean, I wasn't surprised. Yeah, it, it looked like Rebecca like wasn't feeling really well at some point in her match. And uh, I mean, I've had a great you know start of the year. I've been playing really well this week. So um, I mean. I, I wasn't really surprised that they would, you know, give me a match to play because I, I just really showed a really good level, you know, like it was, I was playing really well. So, um, and I was happy to play. I was very happy. Like I, I want to experience those matches and the more I do, the, you know, faster I, you know, propel forward. I believe there are no questions on the Zoom call. So thank you very much, Catherine. Thank you. Thanks.